Ms. Meyer. Terry Robertson Meyer, 4401 Gulf Breeze Boulevard. I see that in executive session today, L7, uh, you're talking about the Harbor Bridge removal. So the city is talking about the Harbor Bridge, and it is something that you are focused on, apparently. Um, I went to the June 23rd meeting that TxDOT held at the um, uh, Solomon Coles High School, and it was a public meeting. And uh, they had some design changes that they had put into effect there on their maps, but they were basically paint on the pavement. That was pretty much it. So they were trying to address our issues in a really cost-cutting way because the designers have already set how much they're going to make. So apparently th those design changes were not uh, sufficient. So we've talked to the state. We were my, The Harbor Bridge Task Force went there, a lot of us, and talked to the state and let them know, uh, both TxDOT and Flatiron Dragados, that those changes that they made for the North Beach Exeter are not going to meet our expectations. Um, so what we want is we want the state, like TxDOT, and the city, like staff, or you guys, to have a town hall on North Beach. Did you know there's never been a posted public meeting on North Beach about the Harbor Bridge? Never. They've all been on the other side of the bridge. So we've all traipsed across the bridge to go to public meetings. And that's good. But I mean, you know, why not have it on North Beach? I mean, I live a thousand feet from the intersection that we're talking about at Beach Avenue. 1,000 feet. I measured it on Google Maps. So I'm like looking at it. And it's going to seriously impact my life. And see that little kid right there? He's going to be 16 when that bridge is completed. He's going to be learning how to drive on a really unsafe intersection. It already is unsafe today. It's scary driving through it because of the Whataburger dumping traffic out into Beach Avenue, Valero dumping traffic into Beach Avenue, going two other ways, and that's where everybody's going to end up. It's unsafe today. Go sit there and watch it for a while. Go over and watch that intersection at noon, any day, and then go, oh, yeah, we don't need to make changes here. It's fine. No, 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 it isn't fine. And when right now a third of that traffic that exits the Harbor Ridge comes off of Beach Avenue. So they're putting all the traffic into that intersection, but making almost no changes. And so two-thirds of the traffic that exit at Burleson right now are going to be put at Beach Avenue. But if you look at the changes that TxDOT is proposing because they're cost-cutting measures, it's stripes on the pavement. We need more than that. So I'm asking you to please figure out how to have, I know you all can't come, but like one or two of you and maybe city staff and TxDOT together, come talk to us. Thank you. Thank you.